Hey, 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 what's going on guys and gals? In this particular video, we're going to go back to the three dots. Believe it or not, we're just about finished with these three dots. We're going to go over the auto mix, the dashboard, and the clear solo. As you can see over here, channels one and two, I've got them soloed real simple. You just click it, solos are off, okay? Now, let's talk about the auto mix feature. Uh, this was designed by a fellow named Dan Dugan, and it's uh, quite ingenious, believe it or not. If you want to do some research on it, just uh, Google his name with uh, Auto Mix. Uh, he designed it back in the 70s, and a lot of people, including myself, we looked at this as a gate, and it's not. Now, this is mixer dependent on the X and M32s. We have the first eight channels that we can apply to the auto mix. And you actually have two settings up here. You've got the X and the Y. Now, the weight, all of this is a mathematical formula, okay? And I'm not going to go into that for this part of the video, but like I said, it is pretty ingenious. So what normally looks like a gate coming down right there is not. That's simply showing you it's, it's a reduction. So right now, the weight of the SM57, that's kind of like the main microphone. So if I move just a little bit closer to it over here, you'll see to where the AKG P120 now is pretty well just reducing while I'm talking into the SM57. But if I pull the AKG P120 over to me, You'll see where the SM57 now, it is reducing in its gain input, giving priority now to the AKG120. And this absolutely works fantastic if you're going to use your mixer at conferences. You've got eight speakers up on stage. It's just a much clearer and cleaner signal coming out of the PA but also for recording and broadcasting events. It's something you have to try and you know, experiment with this, and you'll understand just exactly what I'm talking about. But that's what it is. The more you raise this weight, and that's what that means, if I sit there and just keep raising this up, okay, it's, that's how you assign what microphones you want to be the most active. In this case, the SM57 would be probably the main speaker. And then you can have seven other speakers lined up on this as well. And that's how that feature works. So we're just going to take it off here. And as you can see now, we have nothing going in. So there's no reduction done on either one of these microphones now. Turn it on. You simply go back and you hit the X. And that's all there is about that. Now, I found this to be absolutely fascinating. This is the dashboard. Now, if you're used to using uh, X32 Edit, this is kind of like the all page. But it's all this information right here at your fingertips. It has all of the 32 channel inputs, the auxiliary inputs, the FX returns, all 16 of the mix buses. Okay, your, your sins, uh, your master, your left, right, uh, the mono, all your DCAs. And you can look at it at a glance. And if you look right up here, you'll see this uh, GED, which stands for Gate, EQ, and Dynamics, a.k.a. your compressor. So the beautiful thing about this, you just click on it. There's your channel. There's your overview. So here you can see everything that you want to get to uh, just extremely quick, okay? Literally at the tap of a button. It just doesn't matter which one you click, okay? It'll take you straight to that config page. So it's a real simple way of just being able to go up, see where everything's going, you know, if, you, if you've got mics up there and you, you go here real fast, and all of a sudden you don't see signal coming in and you know there should be signal coming in, it's just a real fast way to sit there and go, you know, channel 12, that should be a kick drum if it's labeled. 
and right here it is, your gain, all of this is at your fingertips. Okay? And I checked this out. This is the exact same with these three dots over here with the iPhone as well as my iPad. Okay? Right there. That's where you're going to find it under the dashboard. Okay? I hope this has helped. Take care. God bless. And we are out of here.